Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk to you about the CalPak Hue Carry-On Luggage with the Hard Shell Pocket. Let's go ahead and do a close up view at the features of the bag. I'm gonna kind of talk to you about why they interested me, what problems I was trying to solve by purchasing this bag and whether or not I think it's going to work for those purposes. So first of all, really nice touch. It comes with a dust bag, which has a very cool kind of, I don't know, diaper bottom, if you will. So you can just unvelcro it at the bottom of the suitcase and lift it off of the top. That way the wheels are never going to be getting the inside of your dust bag dirty. I like that feature because not everybody has a special closet where they keep their luggage. Some people put them in basements, crawl spaces, places that are prone to getting dusty. Keeps your suitcase nice and clean. I purchased this in the color linen. I thought it would be really sharp with the contrast with the black against the linen. Since it is a carry-on and I'm not intending to ever check this luggage, I'm not terribly worried about it getting super dirty. So let's go ahead and start with the exterior features. Top handle, as well as a side lift handle, which kind of bounces out for you, so it tucks in really nicely when you're not using it, but flexes up really easily when you do need it. And if you are using the side carry handle, it has four rubberized feet on the bottom of the other side. Four wheels, 360 degree spin, handle with a top push button, and you've got three different heights for your handle, which I also find to be really sturdy, very easy to pull up and retract. The bag also comes with a TSA approved lock, which is only for the main compartment. The exterior hard shell compartment does not lock into the included TSA zip lock. So if you do want to put things in here that are going to be of value, which you probably will, as you're about to see in a moment, you're going to need a different kind of TSA approved lock to put on these zippers. Dual zipper, one can come all the way around. And I'll give you guys a close up shot of this, but this was a primary selling point in this bag for me. This is an exterior hard shell pocket that you can put a laptop in so it gets off of your back when you are in an airport. You've got room for a 16 inch laptop. You've got room for a tablet if you're somebody who travels with an e-reader or you have a computer and a tablet. And you've got plenty of organization in here for cell phones, easy grab items like your passport and a mesh pocket for charging cords, cables, airport snacks. The other feature about this that I think is really intelligent design is as you can kind of see here, if you don't have a lot of your belongings in the side of the clamshell of the suitcase where the laptop is on the outside, this will retract really nicely and flatten backward in so it's not challenging the zipper of this exterior pocket. However, if you do have a lot of items in that side of your clamshell, this pops out. There are other suitcases that I looked at that have this exterior pocket feature that don't do this. And one of the biggest complaints in the reviews was that if you want to use that exterior pocket, you are sacrificing space inside the suitcase. And that does not seem to be the case with the CalPak Hue carry-on. One more nice feature about this exterior pocket is that it is held up with snaps and Velcros, but if you wanted to undo those on both sides and have this be able to fall open completely, 100% access, you can do that as well. On the inside here, you have a pretty standard clamshell double-sided suitcase. We have the compression strap on the right-hand side and this detachable snap mesh bag, which I think is really nice for separating some smaller items, maybe something that you want to be able to grab really easily. Um, if it's just a quick weekend trip, maybe some smaller dirty items could fit nicely in there. The other nice thing about this is it has some built-in zip pockets on either side. I am somebody who travels with separate little bags for things like jewelry or belts or smaller accessory items. And it is nice that now there's a place, two places actually, where I could just tuck those into my carry-on so I'm not actually taking up any space on the inside where I would be putting clothes, shoes, things that actually need the space. On the side opposite the compression strap, we have a full zip flap and we have two pockets here, both mesh for easy viewing, easy to see what you've got in there. Pretty standard stuff. Here again, you have dual zippers, which I love and you can unzip this side. And here's where you're going to see and perhaps more likely feel. If you push 
the exterior pocket up in. You can see what I was talking about before, about how you kind of could potentially be losing that space. But if you pop it down, you can see you get all of that space back. So you really aren't losing any space on this interior compartment by utilizing that external laptop pocket, which is great. Another reason I went for the CalPAC Hue carry-on over some of its competitors that offered similar models is the size. It's a very compact size carry-on, so you're more likely to be able to carry it onto all different kinds of flights. I did not want a bag where I was kind of going to be flipping a coin as to whether or not it would qualify as a carry-on or need to be checked. And at this size standard, which I'll link this down below for you guys so you can go check it out, um, this one's pretty much guaranteed to be accepted as a carry-on on all flights. My recent videos have been sharing with you guys items that I have been purchasing to make my life easier to pursue minimalism a little bit more. And I shared with you guys in my most recent video that the biggest key to this is identifying what's most efficient, what is the most precision tool that I can use for the task that I need. When I think about ease and efficiency, I am thinking streamlined. I am thinking freedom of movement. I am thinking not being bogged down by a bunch of crap. And if there's one place that a lot of people struggle, myself included, more than anywhere when it comes to being bogged down by a bunch of disorganized stuff, it is when we are traveling. So I wanted a bag that was going to keep my stuff organized, keep my process through the airport, on the airplane, etc., streamlined and comfortable, and keep me able to move as efficiently as possible, hands-free wherever possible, not rummaging through bags, being able to keep it moving quickly. So I loved the idea of getting the laptop off of my back, to keeping that weight off my back, alleviating some of that shoulder pain, that low back pain, that discomfort that you get up in your traps when you're standing in line waiting to board. Also, I'm not somebody who necessarily needs to access my laptop all the time while I'm on the plane. So having it in my carry-on, super easy. But if you do need to access it on the plane, then you can just grab it out really easily before you throw this in the overhead bins. I like the ability to consolidate that with all of my clothes and toiletries and other things that I'm gonna be needing for my trips, as opposed to combining it with the more easy access, quick stuff that I'm gonna be having on my back or in my handbag. That's all I've got for you guys on the CalPAC Hue carry-on, my new minimalist carry-on suitcase. I have another fun minimalist travel item that I'm going to be sharing with you guys next week, so subscribe and stay tuned for that. I will have this bag linked down below so you can go to the website and read about all the specs and other information you might want on it, but I hope that you find it suits your minimalist traveling needs as well. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions I can answer, leave them in the comments below. See you soon. Bye-bye.